Sorry, everybody. Welcome back here to Columbus Wired. I'm here with the one, the only Kyle Harrison. Kyle, you're 14. Yep. Your tremendous career. Yeah. What do you attribute this longevity to? Uh, I love the game, man. I love the game, and I've been fortunate enough. Uh, I've gotten to do it full time as a professional. I think a lot of the times uh, in the past, you've, you've had guys that play in the MLL or play professionally, and then after two or three years of that, like work gets really stressful or something happens that like they, they can't allocate the amount of time necessary uh, to be productive and while playing while doing everything else they have going on at work and I've been fortunate with my partners and sponsors that uh, I get to be a full-time lacrosse player so it's been a lot of fun man and, and again I just I love it. You are a leader on this team definitely and some of the younger players look up to you. Is there anybody that's kind of catching your eye early on in this training camp? Look, man, we were just talking a lot. About all these young guys are so creative. I think the game, uh, the game, as far as where it is at the college level, you know, just we were watching college games a lot. The rest of the risks these kids take, the passes they throw, the way they shoot the ball, everything, uh, the defenders, how aggressive they are. So there, we had we had a great camp. A bunch of young guys did a great job for us. Hey, I mean, I see a lot of these guys going full throttle, going right to the goal, paying the price, yep. getting that goal. But man, yeah, that's that's truly exciting. Yeah. You've spent a lot of time in a lot of cities around the country. As we've said, you've got a storied career there. Talk about your time in Central Ohio a little bit so far. It's been great. You know, I think uh, my, my relationship with the Ohio lacrosse community has been an important one for me because I came back to the MLL after being gone for five years. Uh, and I wasn't really sure how I was going to be accepted, right? I started a competing thing <laughs> to the MLL, left. Um, and then once I, you know, we figured out the partnership, I came back and I wasn't really sure how to be accepted. So when the Ohio Machine picked me up and then I got to be involved in the community and everything we're doing here with the vets. And then last year we got to, to do some stuff uh, with some growth initiatives here. So it's, it's been a lot of fun, man. And I, uh, again, they, they've embraced me with open arms and it's oh important. My God. So you're a Hopkins guy here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, I, I was a big fan of Jesse Schwartzman. And if you want to talk a little bit about yeah. him, is there uh, any fond memories you have with the big guy? So Jesse is a good buddy of mine. He was uh, my lifting partner oh, for wow. two years. <laughs> yeah. So I, I had, what was it like to spot him? It wasn't great. <laughs> it wasn't great. Uh, but Je no, Jesse, to his credit, man, Jesse came in. Uh, he wasn't a worker when he got to Hopkins, and by the time he left, he was one of the hardest workers we had on the team. So he, I mean, he's obviously he's one of the best goalies of all time. Uh, but his work ethic, the switch changed from the time he got there to the time he left. Excellent. And then lastly, I'll let you let you go on this note. There's still a lot of folks that. You know, you said Central Ohio is a pretty big lacrosse community. Some folks might be on the fence. How would you sell a casual fan on the Ohio Machine experience? Look, man, I think we got high level lacrosse, right? We got an incredible facility. I think, you know, sports entertainment, professional, that's what this is, right? Like, it's a fun show. You can see it's right on the sideline. You can be right in the mix, hear the players interacting, uh, see how fast paced our game is. I think the game at the professional level um, is so exciting because of that shot clock. So, literally, there's no dull moment, right? Like, if there's a save, you got 60 seconds to get the ball down to the other end and score a goal or shoot the ball or have something happen. And if not, it's coming back this way. So it's just a really entertaining game. The Ohio Machine organization and front office has done an incredible job creating a great experience for both the players and the fans. And uh, if you're a lacrosse fan, and if you're not a lacrosse fan, this is the time to come watch. That's going to do all our time today. Mr. Kyle Harrison, thank you so much for coming with us. Stay with Columbus Wired. We'll be here all season long with the Ohio Machine as they look to defend their 2017 MLL Championship.